What's going on? My name is Aaron and I'm bringing you another Battle Bond Booster Pack opening. Today we have six packs. Let's see what we can do. I am in love with the land cycle. I, got, I looked it up. They're called Bond Lands. So we're, we're looking for those for sure. Doubling season, land tax, a bunch of fantastic potential pulls. Uh, I've said it before, foil mythics and rares in this set can get out of control price-wise. The multipliers are insane. So let's see. All right, pack one. All right, we have a Crawl Warrior as a common foil. And we have a rare Sentinel Tower. Check through the uncommons briefly. Nothing super valuable. That's a good card. Put that to the side. How's everybody doing today? Hopefully, hopefully enjoying themselves. I um, <clears throat> am changing up the camera angle a little bit on this video, and I think this is the way I'll probably go for it. It's easier to see the cards, and there's less glare, which I was having massive issues with, so. All right. There's our zombie token. My piles are not on point, but that's okay. I'll figure it all out later for the most part. Let's get our rare out here. And swamp into a new scrap mob. So good for your zombie decks, I suppose. I wonder if we're gonna get a solid mythic in this set of packs. I've heard, did, did y'all hear about the double masters coming out? So it's like ma uh, master sets returning. There's like two rares, two foils. It's in each pack, they're gonna be like 30 plus dollars a pack to start. $300 a box on Amazon right now. Uh, I guarantee those boxes are gonna go up to like six or seven. It's gonna be crazy. They're just, they're milking us at this point, <clears throat> but uh, there's amazing cards in there so far that we've seen. There's only four or five, but you know, we'll, we'll see what happens. What do we get here? Sower of Temptation. And that's a good card, you know, three or four dollar card. Uh, two colorless and two blue for a fairy wizard with flying. When Sower of Temptation enters the battlefield, gain control of target creature for as long as Sower of Temptation remains on the battlefield. It's always good. We like controlling other people's creatures. That's an amazing card there too. Anytime you can draw a card. Let's go Mythic. On to our fourth pack here. I still have a bunch of these packs left, at least a half a box after this so it's a rare mangara of corondor it's one colorless two white for a legendary creature human wizard that you can tap oops sorry drop it down a little bit and uh exile mangara and target permanent so it's always nice to to be able to do that you know on the fly i like it very cool Exiling something is much better than putting it in the graveyard. Still no mythic. I think this is the pack. Rare. It's a partner. Yeah, these <clears throat> these partners are not very good. Okan, Eye of Chaos, and Z I don't even know how you begin to pronounce that. Zinder split, yeah, Zinder split. I guess that, I guess that's it. Eye of Wisdom, and they're partners. You can read that here. I'll put it up. You can read it if you'd like. I don't want to go into that. They're not that great. I know that. Good old shock. I mean, all right, last pack. I guess we're not gonna get a mythic question mark or. Maybe we'll get, we're going to get two Mythics in our next box. That's what's going to happen. If not, all right, let's see. 
Uncommon foil. Oh. Oh, that was weird. Okay. So, because foils come in pair, partners come in pairs, we got that pair. Very nice. Beautiful. And a Spire Garden. So, we didn't hit our value, I don't think. I think we were going for about $21 for this set of five packs. But Spire Garden's always sought after. And I think they're going to go up quite a bit. So, I'm very happy with that. All right. Well, hey, thank you very much for joining me today. We're going to have an Ikoria booster box opening coming up very shortly as well. So look forward to that. We'll see you on the next video.